Welcome everybody, this is Gold Leader, I'm joined by Patronus, and we are here for some Star Wars TCG live play. What's up everybody? So last week we played some budget decks on stream. It was a Rebel Swarm deck versus an Imperial budget deck. I've kind of updated that budget deck a little bit. Um, not to make it so much budget, it's still pretty budget. Uh, it, it does have some rares in it though now that are kind of expensive so it's kind of like in the middle um there's not as many expensive rares um but i upgraded it a little bit to be a little bit more competitive but it's also still super thematic so this is really i would call this just a straight empire battle of hoth type deck all right you want to show any of the cards before we start playing or you yeah. want to just i mean i could show a couple and uh, we are going to post the desk deck list as usual so the whole point of this deck revolves around um i call this deck vader matters because the deck many of the cards re revolve around darth vader being in play specifically that darth vader so there are two darth vaders from empire strikes back that i would call build around me cards the whole point of those cards is to build an entire deck around that strategy okay. we've seen the vader h1 that is the one that gives plus two power to all of your all of your units, but if your units fail to deal damage, they have to be discarded. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of like Vader's like yeah, do this thing, Vader. or now Vader ch them. Vader yeah. chokes him out mm -hmm. essentially. Super thematic card. Um, this Vader actually allows you to search your deck for a dark side battle card at the cost mm -hmm. of two force. Okay. So the deck is loaded with I think twelve battle cards. Wow. All okay. of them are dark side. Okay. So you have this like really fun utility box where you could search for cards at specific times, mm -hmm. which could be very powerful. Mm -hmm. Now you are limited because the dark side doesn't have a single damage prevention card that is dark side. Really? Every damage prevention card in the game is either light side or neutral. Well, that's not true. There is one dark side card, but it costs six force. Wow. All right. So... And it's arena specific. <clears throat> so that's the whole point of this deck. The rest of the deck is just going to be Hoth based. There's going to be a bunch of walkers, um, elite, snow, elite snow trooper squad, which you've seen this card on stream before. It's a yep. fantastic card, uncommon. It's got Vader on the card. Basically, as long as Vader's in play, this unit cannot be discarded. It just it gets retreats. retreats. Right. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then space is just some good Imperial units. So I kind of want to try it out. Um, okay. And I thought we could uh, play a match and see how good this deck is. Alrighty. So. And you're just playing your two decks. Okay. So I do want to start with this deck since this is what we've been talking about. Sure. Grabbing my light side deck. Yep. Apparently I don't have any extra sleeves on that one. Oh, because these are different sleeves. So, Vader sleeves for the Vader deck. Of course. Gotta be themey. I actually had to, uh, we were actually getting really low on sleeves, so I broke down all the Star Wars LCG decks. Oh. There was like 20 decks that were yeah. sleeved. And that makes uh, sense. I was like, ooh, more, more sleeved sleeves. sleeves. Yeah. Uh, we really haven't touched Star Wars LCG. No, I, I've not minded the idea of going back yeah. to that with some thematic pairings because that game is really, it's interesting in its complexity. It's a it's, little too complex. It's, but oh, yeah. yeah. So if you play decks that are well suited to each other to play against each other, they're fun. it's super fun. Yeah. But there's a lot of decisions in that game. That's one of the problems. It, it kind of falls into the FFG, LCG um, problems where many of their games require so many decision trees in the course of, like, a single phase. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, you've never played, like, L5R right. or, like, ga even Game of Thrones. Yeah. I think you might have played I Game, did of, a Thrones games once. Game of Thrones once. But... Every time you attack in Game of Thrones, there's the consideration is 
this a power challenge? Right. Is this a military. intrigue challenge or a military challenge? Right. And so when you've got like four or five units and then you're making these decisions right. for each, the games could just get it's silly. And so crazy, yeah. Star Wars LCG has the same thing. It doesn't have different types of combats, but the consequence, right. you know, like the blowouts. It's, yeah, the blowout is insane yeah. if you make the wrong choice. Yeah, yeah. it's very penalizing. Mm-hmm. Uh, Kid Gray says he has the same sleeves as us. These are the best sleeves ever. Yeah. I will say, as much as I disliked <laughs> you buying a case and a half of sleeves at once. <laughs> it was a smart investment, wasn't it? They are by far the best sleeves yeah. that I have ever used that have artwork on the backs of them. Right, because they don't peel. Yeah. You could have sleeves for a long yeah. time, and they're and we yeah. we're side shufflers. We we yeah. we shuffle to the side a lot. Yeah, and I have tiny little baby hands and big decks that are double sleeved are very hard for me to shuffle. So I naturally like end up bending the corners a little bit because it's just that I can't yeah. not do that because I have tiny little baby hands. All right. <sighs> so if you're kind of new into Star Wars LCG or Star Wars TCG, um. This is not a bad, if, like, you're a Vader fan, yeah. right? This is not very a bad Vader. deck to aspire to build. Yeah. Um, and it's fun. It feels Vader. I, I've played that deck before, or at least You've played a variant of, of, yeah. Yeah. It's it's fun. This is probably one of my person. favorite builds with Darth Vader. The other build, the Vader H build, is a little more all-in. Like, it's very swingy with that deck. You're yeah. either, like got so much power from all these units and you're crushing your opponent or you're just getting crushed. It's right. it's, it's there's not one a, or the other. not a lot of middle ground. A lot ground. of the uh swarmy decks in his like game the combo like decks, yeah. yeah. The combo we swarmy decks are low. It can be like that for sure. Yeah. All right, I mulliganed three cards and I'm now shuffling them back in. Holy smokes, mulligans. All right, one, <laughs> two, three, four. I mean, that wasn't a holy smokes mulligan. Four it happens. You're making it sound like you're gonna have to discard all of them. I thought it was well. The first four cards I looked at were ah, uh, were all that were makes all, more sense. Were all those cards? We're all sideways. Yeah. Yeah. So we are doing obviously our our uh, I suppose league mulligan rule. I'm not sure what we're officially going to call it. It's but gonna it, right now. It's the league mulligan rule, but I mean. Talking with the IDC, um, it's going to be the official mulligan roll yeah. at some point um, for any IDC play. Yeah. Um, as far as I consider it, I, I haven't found any reason to stick with the original mulligan rule. I don't think there's a reason for the mulligan rule to be punishing and for you to lose cards yeah. totally to a game. Yep. Um, it's a very fair mulligan because, like I said, like, yeah, sure, I just mulliganed four cards, but now my deck is also juiced with four more cards to right. draw during setup so it doesn't necessarily give me a huge advantage, a huge advantage. it yeah. just gives me the opportunity to not get stuck during setup right which if you've ever played this game the probably the worst feeling is not even rolling bad it is getting stuck on build points yeah. during setup uh-huh. having a game where you like oh i'm stuck at 20 yeah and your opponent has 10 more build than yeah. you it's you might as well just you might... that game and go on <laughs> yep <laughs> all right Dark side starts. Three in space. Favorite. Uh, this has got to be my favorite. Just vanilla. Vanilla. Utility sp- ship. For Three sure. build points. Critical. Um. Critical hit one. Mm-hmm. Intercept. Intercept. The intercept is. The key. dark side. Before this card came out, the dark side was. I felt like at such a disadvantage in space. Yeah. Well, yeah, because all the starfighters are well, so powerful. Well, especially in the Phantom Menace, the light side got Delta Six. Right. All the the three power, three cost, mm-hmm. critical hit, of pay one, evade one. Yeah. And then dark dark side getting this was a big deal. Yeah. All right, I'm uh, gonna play tried and true. Yoda J. Oh, I hate him. He's fantastic. Oh, I love Yoda. I, I forgot to draw after Six Cardinal Sin. For me. And. Uh, Okay. Two, three, I've done that a lot on Lackey. I've noticed when I've been playing my online matches, I forget <laughs> to, to draw, draw card. the card yeah. in Lackey. I'm You're like, I look three bad. options. I'm like, why? <laughs> what the heck is going on? And I realize I forget to draw sure. because I'm not used to that interface. Okay. <clears throat> Go ahead. Well, it's a Vader deck, right? Yeah, might as well. So 
I wish I had the eight cost one, but I don't. Oh, so you can build to it. I'm just gonna play that. Oh, ten! Holy but Jesus! All right. Yep. So you're at thirteen. Yep. So if you haven't seen this Vader, this is, in my opinion, <clears throat> the best uncommon Darth Vader you could get. Which one is he? So Armor, he... pay two force. He gets plus two power and stun two. Oh, the stun two. And pay X of 8X? Wow. Pay I don't X. know that I've seen that one. Yeah, so you probably haven't seen it a lot because it's a lot of people have played Vader R at 10 right. build over him or Vader S. Yeah. Um, but as an uncommon, if you don't want to spend a lot of money. <clears throat> yeah, he's got a lot of utility. That stun is a big deal. In well, character. especially when you have armor combined right. with it. So, like, you stun. Yeah. You stun something, and then now they're rolling less dice. You and have armor, armor, and then you have the most efficient. Of yeah, I've eight pay ever. X. I've, yeah, I don't know anybody. Any so the only unit character. has pay X. Yeah, that's X, amazing. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna start with a Yoda stack here. One. So I will say, hard. I have hardly any units in my hand, but I promise you guys, I can't run out of build. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot. All right. <laughs> All right. So Sounds I like some ten... Endor Imperial fleets are in my in my. I did it for you. It's thirteen. Oh yeah, you did. I had do it, it for you already. All right, cool. All right, we're gonna continue stacking in Yoda here. Two. Full stacked Yoda during setup seems good. That's annoying. And the lightning Yoda too. Yeah, he's underneath. <clears throat> okay. And so, yeah, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep. And then let's do. Four. Mm -hmm. Over there. So we're tied. Yeah. And that's why it's awesome to stack and set up like that. You you've seen you see, I've seen so many so cards. many cards in comparison to me. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> Obviously, if you guys have any questions about our gameplay or anything related to um, Star Wars TCG in general, or the how to uh, work with the IDC community, just let us know. Oh yeah, I guess I should probably put my ships on there. I played an IG two thousand. And X Luke's X Wing D. Okay. I'm at seventeen. Okay. You were at seventeen. Yep. Well. <clears throat> well, 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 well. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Well, um let's go with the executor. Ooh. That seems angry. So Lordy. that's eleven. Okay. So there's six. So another six and five. Uh, so three, I put a seven, seventeen, twenty-eight. Right? Yeah. Okay. So you're missing. Your yeah, your math is off. I, I, think. I don't think so. Twenty-one, twenty-five, twenty-eight. Twelve. That's 24, 24, 29? Yeah. All right. <clears throat> All right. So, that drunk. happened, guys. I don't know if that's a good thing. I don't have uh, Luke's X-Wing B, so my odds of dealing with that executor are kind of nil. Okay. So, with that said... <clears throat> Let's Let's do three here. Draw. Mm-hmm. Fudge muffins. Okay. And uh 
Andrea did design us um, a brand new playmat to play on stream. And I got word that it is printed so I can go Ooh. pick it up. So next week we'll have a new playmat where we can uh, have the force counters up on it. And yeah. it'll be sweet. So we're doing that. And we're doing Sebulba's Pod Racer. <clears throat> Man. Pod racing, huh? <clears throat> mm-hmm. So Andrea's and... just playing, um, for you guys, Andrea's just playing her standard, like, I guess you would say her actual competitive deck mm -hmm. if she were going to play in a tournament, which we've played it on stream before. It's kind of like, her, I, I can't really, it's not really an archetype other than it has Yoda in it. Yeah, that's just because I like Yoda. It's just because... Like, in general. Not of, I like the cards Yoda, I like the character Yoda. Yeah, yeah. Out of all, Andrea was like, you need to build me a deck and... It has to have Yoda, and it has to have uh, R2-D2 R2 and droids <laughs> in it. And I was like, okay. <clears throat> All right, so I'm using the last of my build on the uh, Jedi Coruscant shuttle. Okay. I am not going to deploy it. I'm just uh, going to have the four build on that's it. That's convenient. Very. Okay. So, yeah, let's have fun. So what I have? Two build left? Two left. Hmm. I mean... So this is kind of funny. <laughs> Normally you probably wouldn't see that <laughs> come as the last two build points, but that's what I'm putting it on. Okay. So when I get 13, that bad boy will come into play. That'll take a hot minute, but all right. Okay. <clears throat> Setup complete. Yep. So roll for... Light side, roll for build. All right. Roll. That's the wrong die to use. Oh, that's definitely the wrong die. You can't even see it. Yeah. You got the same result. Hilarious. Four. Four. Okay. So we each have five... Yep. ...builds. And force points. Mm -hmm. All right. And I'm going to draw for turn. Oh, there he is. Five build points, huh? Huh. Okay. We are going to spend one build point. We're going to stack Darth Vader. Sure. And then we're going to spend four build points here. <laughs> okay. Done? Yeah. All right. So my upkeep on IG, I have to either discard a card or tap that unit. I am going to choose to... Discard uh, Redemption, because I'm probably not going to play that. And we're going to deploy my Coruscant Shuttle. So I'm going to go look for a Jedi card. deck. Figuring out what I want. <clears throat> so I don't know how I'm going to win this game. Um, Yoda's super annoying. Quad stacked. I'm, the reason I built a salt group is I think I'm going to have to win this game in ground for sure. Maybe care, Maybe space? Luckily, she can't. She, only Jedi she can search for in space is like Anakin or Obi Wan, which I'm not really super concerned with. Um, so we'll see. Yeah. Um, decisions, decisions. All right. I think. Think I might go get. Do the chain. Oh, okay. No, go get Luke. Uh, okay, sure. Yeah. 
That's true. She can get that, which mm-hmm. is kind of like searching for Luke's X-Wing. It is It is exactly like searching for Luke's X-Wing, effectively. Yeah. So I will play him with my five build. Well, that's gross. Yeah. And I will move him to pilot his <clears throat> Starfighter. That is terrible for yeah. me. Yeah. Um, I could lose this game on the first turn. Uh, oh, I don't, you can't lose it on the first turn because you can intercept. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's but that's gross. I guess it depends on how well you. It's a lot of pressure. Okay. Dice. Okay. Dark side retreats. I have no retreats. Neither do I. All right. So I'm still sixty. Yep. So let's roll. I get five dice because of the executor. Yeah. Uh, Hmm. Oh, I guess when space starts, I get to choose a thing. Yep, power so, or speed. Yeah, so he can either have plus 20 speed or plus 2 power. And get getting gosh. speed is not going to do anything yeah, for me, so, so we're obviously just going to get power. Yep. So I can roll 4 dice at Luke's X-Wing. Mm-hmm. But Luke has evade. Yeah, evade to evade to, yeah. And... Hmm. Okay. Or I could roll five dice at IG. So evading does put pressure on her force. So I'm gonna I'm gonna roll at Luke's X Wing. Okay. He doesn't have lucky, but the shields it's annoying. Yeah. Oh Good Lord. Hello. Yahtzee. Uh, That's five hits. Uh, yeah, it is. So, we are going to pay two of A2 uh-huh. and use pay one for a high-speed dodge. Okay. And I'll pay four force to prevent that. Fudge. That is a dead loot sex wing. That's Change in so destiny. sad. No! Oh, man. That was huge. That was that was the game. Now, that's not the game. No, I mean, like, that was the game changer, I should say. Yeah, it, 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 I mean, Vader has no force in character, so yeah, that's true. he can get blown up by uh, Yoda this turn. Ugh. All right, so <laughs> now you're up. All right. So he's rolling six dice. He will try and go with the uh, executor. Okay. Ooh, four, five hits. Yeah. Oh, yeah, five hits. Yep, he has critical hit, too. Wait, six, yeah, yeah five mm-hmm. hits, ouch. Okay. All right, half dead. <clears throat> All right, ten dice back. Yep. Oh, that one's four. cocked. Five. Five. Uh, yeah, all uh four because the armor. So just four hits. Still enough. Okay. He's not fast enough for high speed dodge. She has no evade. Nope. Oh yes, he is. He's fifty speed. No, oh no, not. you he's chose. 30. You chose thirty. Yep. I also don't have another high speed dodge. Uh, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. Okay. Nor do I have a Jedi pilot. Okay. All right. Well, that was sad. Space that went sideways. Might of the Empire. <clears throat> All right. So then ground. I've got an 80. Uh-huh. So... I mean, I think you just attack. You just have yeah, to deal it Yeah, because I got three. enough. Yeah, Why I got deal enough the damage. Attackers. I agree. So I roll two dice for me, please. Was this played during setup? Yes, it was. So, so it does have a damage. damage on it. Yep. You're right. I'm okay. just used to not doing that, but I had no choice. Um, You know what? We've got some... These really stand out nice on camera. Sure, that's fine. Okay, um, so, yeah, you're, so you're rolling two. Yep. All right. Zero. Zero. All then right. you're rolling four? Then I'm rolling four. Two. Mm-hmm. And then you're, so we're going to put two on it. And then you've got... And then three. Three. Oh, that's a three, sir. Okay. Well, he has three damage. Oh, no, he doesn't. There's the one. There's the one. All right. All right so He's all retreated. the damage is 
removed, he's retreated. Yep. Okay. So if you haven't seen what this card does, basically as long as Vader's in the character arena, you remove all the damage and should retreat him. Dice out. Oh yeah, I should pull the dice out. <laughs> okay. And then And then character. So I have 70? 40, 50, 60, 70. Yep, yeah, all right. It's all you. No, Dark Side wins dies. I'm 60. Oh, I thought you said you were 70. No, 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 I was saying you were 70. Got it. Yeah, All right, 60. so we will roll five, six, seven, eight dice at Yoda. Okay. Or I'm sorry, at Vader. Yep. And I have no force, which is pretty bad. But it felt worth it to kill Luke's X-Wing. I mean, that was pretty good. Uh, Reroll two of those misses, please. Well, first... Okay. And, uh... All right, so hold on. So these are your hits. These two, because right. he has armor. So yep. we're going to re-roll these two. Yep. We'll take out all these. Mm -hmm. Three hits. Yep. Okay. So, three damage on Vader. Okay. And then Vader gets to roll eight dice. Mm-hmm. And I draw four, I think, right? Yeah, yep. the old Yoda. One, two, three. Hmm. These Marvel Champion uh, Carbo tokens work nice. They're, yeah, they're based on fine. orange and white. Yeah. It's easy to see in stream. Yeah. All right. I guess we'll do that. All right. These on the bottom. Oh, yeah. I get to roll. It's not the end of the turn. Yeah. Uh, wow. Two. Can you roll your two hits, please. One. Oh, and did I roll enough dice? Yeah, I did. Wait, hold on. I got one hit. I rolled eight dice. I should have rolled one more. Two hits. All right. So you take one. You evade. Oh, you have no evade. I can't. All right. yeah. Oh man, that was an opportunity. Yeah. I missed that opportunity. Mm -hmm. I mean, we both had it because yeah. we both used all of our force and space. Yeah, yeah. I just, I, I just forgot. I was like, oh, I was thinking I wasn't doing anything to him. All right, rolling for build. Two. Two. Okay. And I'm going to draw. Oh, four force. We are going to spend two here. And you're up. All right. Drop. I'm just going to put two right there. All right. Dark side retreats. No retreats. No retreats. All right. No retreats for me either. So, nothing here. Yep. And we're just going to roll dice. So, roll two. Mm-hmm. One. One damage. Roll four. Zero. That's bad. Roll three. Two. two. There we go. Retreated. Got nervous. He almost got to attack there. Yeah. All right. Yoda. Yep. Eight dice. Mm-hmm. 
Ouch. Holy fours. Three. Okay, uh, we will two of them. So we got three hits. We're rolling two. Nice. Four hits. One more. All right, four. All right. Well. That's. Got some cards, or are you going to just pay I'm to just, evade? Just going to pay it all. I'll evade. Evade. Four. four. Okay. All right. All right, nine with Vader. Holy smokes. Jeez. Hello, Vader. Uh, re-roll two of them. Yeah. Why couldn't you roll like that for me? Uh, you know. Huh. Oh my god. Okay, so we got a seven from Vader. He might be dead. Nah, he's not dead. I mean, I can pay two to evade two. And take five. And take five, and he has five... He has Six, one left. seven, eight. He has one health left. Yeah. Jeez. Anybody uh, in chat actually feel bad for Yoda J? Because I know I don't. I mean, that's no just one else rude. does. You should roll my dice that well. <laughs> I did roll well. All right. Not seven damage well. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I guess the one downside to us only having one dice cam on stream. I sit next to the dice cam. Yeah. So I just roll the dice for both players. Yeah. But I've been a notoriously bad roller, so this is actually kind of weird. My nickname for the longest time actually was not Gold Leader. It was not Longshanks. It was Captain Can't Roll. Yeah. Because I literally threw the World Championship away. Yeah. I rolled, if you know what this card is, Trade Federation Control Core. I needed to win my match into the top eight. I needed to get two damage... Rolling 12 dice with the Trade Federation Control Core to win the game. I roll the one. Yep. One for 12. Contra says it's good that you don't roll that well in Lackey. Oh, Lackey's even worse. Yeah. Okay, so next turn. Yeah. Hey, at least we've been rolling decent build points this game. Three build. Four force. <clears throat> And draw. Let's do two build points here. Mm. And. That's a problem. Yeah, we got a little bombard action in space. You want to hand me a three, actually? Yeah. Thanks. And then I have one build point left. And I think what we're going to do is put it here. And I'm done. <clears throat> I'm in a world of trouble here, guys. That's why you play best of three. Yep. All right. Yeah, that change of destiny on turn one was so cute. And that one. Huh? You just cracking Yoda for five <laughs> yeah. was that like those were two really massive swings. That I power of the, the dark di side. The, the dice gods <laughs> smite me, smote me, whatever the. Mm, you know how it goes. Sometimes the <laughs> dice gods giveth, and sometimes they taketh away. Yeah. Thing is, I don't even know what I can get that'll help me win. All right, I guess we'll use one on a on a cloud city. Sure. And then we'll use my last two to deploy another shuttle. Okay. And I will go look for I don't even know what. The sad part is you could always look for another copy of Yoda J. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know that You'll I'll be able to play stack. them. You'll lose the stack. Yeah. You're so far behind in space. 
Yeah, I can't catch him. I can't. Not not now. Yeah. Not when you one shot Luke's X Wing before you got to go. Yeah, Dark One would be helpful if you could keep Yoda J alive a turn. Yeah, but I, you have got. I also have to go the player. Yeah, but that's probably your best. That's kind of what I was thinking. You're probably your most my helpful. Best bet. Just because of the intercept. And then I can still like have something in character to not just die. Yeah. Yeah. It's not great. It's not great, but I think it's the best I can do. Okay, I am done. All right. Dark I have side retreats. Zero retreats. I'd say retreats also none. All right, space. Space taps. Nope. Bombard. Oh, that's right. Fudge my fun. Bombard yeah. four. All right. And bombard four critical hit two will roll at Sabola. I got three damage on Sabola. And then, nothing else in ground, so we're just going to character, and yep. Yoda's up. Alright, roll um, is... I'm actually going to try to play a card before Yoda attacks. I'm going to play Lightsaber Throw for two force, and it deals three damage to a character. Alright, well we're disrupting that. Okay. Dismiss. Alright. What are you discarding for it? A space unit. <laughs> okay. Hey, it was worth a try. All right. All right. So now Yoda's rolling his eight dice. Yep. And this could get swingy. Like, Yoda could just, with Lucky 2, could just roll really good. Fingers crossed. I got my fingers crossed up here, guys. Roll well for me, babe. All right. So we got two hits. Only two. Lucky 2. Just two hits. Right. So he is going to. Huh. Boy, do I take these two hits? Yeah, I'm going to take them. We're going to go to five on Vader. Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah. This is a decision. If I go to five on Vader, he has three health left. Two. Two health. He's at seven. He has two. Could get lightsaber quick draw, but that's only if you have Anakin's pod racer in your hand. I think it's worth the gamble to make sure I kill Yoda this turn. I don't have a way to have hit him with lightsaber quick draw. I don't know. It's just gamble. I'm just telling you. All right, spend it. Your gamble was correct. All right, two, <laughs> four. Otherwise, I would have done it. <laughs> seven dice, two from the executor, and then two more for um, plus two power and stun. So. Oh, Jesus. Lucky two. Mm -hmm. All right. So we got a lot of hits here, which is good. We're going to lucky two. Oh, but you also get to search four. Yeah. Which is huge. High speed dodge, high speed dodge, high speed dodge. Oh! Oh, Yoda. So, so good. So you can prevent three and evade two. Correct. And it only costs you three force. Correct. And he lives. Uh, no, it cost me two force because this is free. Oh, right, right. Yeah, that was the uh, that was the gamble. All right. Okay. Didn't have it in my hand though. We had to dig for it. All right. Roll for build. One. One. Oh my god. It's not good. It's so bad. All right. One, huh? One's kind of terrible. It's really terrible. All right, let's put him in. Uh, we're just going to stack Vader. And you keep them Great. alive. Give him an extra hit point. Uh, we got this building, uh, Vader's Meditation Chamber, so we might as well put it into play. Sure. And we're done. Bye. That's fine. That means you're not building a unit or stacking something. So we're playing a Rebel Hanger? Mm-hmm. There's nothing for me to stack. This thing Nothing's takes a damage. Yeah. Alrighty. That's all I got. Alright. Okay. Space. Space. Taps. We're going to oh, bombard. No. Yeah. That's Let's, your target. Uh, good question. So you're going to heal one of them. Mm -hmm. 
Let's uh, go here. Okay. So I get four dice. Mm-hmm. All right, four at Sebulba. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. I only needed one. I know, but... Okay. All right, and go to ground. We will yep. heal him. Mm-hmm. And we will swing some dice. Four. You got it. Four. Two. You're up. Three. Okay. And now I'm faster. I'm 70. All right, and I'm going to pay two force to pump him. So, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think I'm using all the dice, and I'm short one. Two, four, six, two for the stack, two for the executor, and two for the stunt. So, yeah, I'm short a die, but that's okay. I'll that's reroll one. Okay. So just, yeah, re-roll that, and that's your... And then I have one die, so I'm going to roll that. Okay. Ugh. Now I'm going to re-roll two. Yeah. All right. All right. But that's six, six incoming six. damage. And he has one health left. So six even a high-speed do dodge does not Which do it. I have. It. Six is going to do it. All right, I lost. Did you search for four, too? Yeah. Okay. And got another high-speed dodge. Well, I didn't know if you had one, and then yeah. you searched... Could it? Because if you had two, then... I didn't. All right. I had to dig for the last one. Vader was... got there. That was so swingy. All right. I think uh, let's play switch sides, and then we can bid on the third game. Okay. What? That's fine. All right. So we're going to switch sides. I got one of uh, Katra's favorite cards in this deck. He's watching. Ula. I don't even remember what this deck is. Oh, yeah, okay. I don't think you... Was your deck sorted? Was that one sorted? See, we're playing it recently. So this is the um, this deck here is a light side, I don't know, kind of rogues and scoundrels deck, I guess. Or it's basically Han, uh, Lando, like all the light side smuggler mm -hmm. characters. best thing I love about this game, even with like, even with all the imperfections and, in uh, you know, some cards are just so badly made. <laughs> um, after ten sets with just Wizards of the Coast cards, man, there are so many different deck builds that you can make that you can play. And then once you get in the IDC, it becomes infinite. I'll be excited to learn the IDC cards with the whole group. If you don't know what the IDC is, and you're watching this video, they are the player-run committee that have been keeping the game alive since 2015, mm -hmm. and th or actually no, 2005. Like 2005. I apologize. Add 10. <laughs> Add 10 years. 2005. They have 30 made fan sets. You can go to the IDC site. Just Google Star Wars TCG IDC. Um, it'll be the first result. Or you can also go to StarWarsTCG.com. You can check out all the cards there. It's a card in. Uh, uh, deck builder database and you can look at every card it's uh, really awesome and the IDC is actually working on remasters um, basically high digital remakes of the original Wizards of the Coast cards because because the game's so old Wizards actually never released 
digital digital, digital scans like right. high definition scans of the cards right so they literally unless someone someone gets all the cards puts them in a scanner like that's the only scans that exist yeah. of every card so they actually went through starting with attack of the clones and have been digitally remastering essentially those sets mm-hmm. so you'd have high quality images Alrighty, I'm ready to go. Okay. And I'm going to log in twice. And you're up, Darkseid. Let's do Masameda for three. You love that card, don't you? He's good. So Andrew's dark side deck is super thematic. I tried to make it as um, prequel themed as possible on the mm-hmm. dark side. Yeah, we wanted uh, the emperor and his apprentice. Yeah. Theme. Mm-hmm. Um. Yeah, it's just an awesome separatist deck. Yeah, really. very separatisty. Yeah. All right. So we'll do two. And then we are going to do three in space for five. Okay. And you're up. So I'll put my cards in here. This is a super popular card. It's in a million of the competitive decks just for its cost and its speed has a little downside we could spend force and get tapped yeah uh this card's probably not played as much as it probably should be but it's just a three cost yeah, starfighter just... it doesn't have a lot of attack dice so i think that's why people shy away from it yeah but it has but 60, 60 speed yeah. so you can kill those like one health droid missiles that or one health yeah. uh ds um one vr yeah the, 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 the kamikaze, kamikaze droids yeah. so i played a moss and then I am playing a Reek. Nice. So I'm at six. Yeah, a lot of people hate on the Reek, but I think the Reek's fine. It's cheap and it's efficient. Yeah, I mean... The, the, it doesn't have a lot of health, but... Yeah, I mean, the a lot of people like it for the... Um, they prefer, like, the Java Sandcrawler. Sure. It, for one more build point, it yeah. has that big seven health. Yeah. The only thing is, we were trying to go for theme. So right. we wanted that, like, mm-hmm. from the movie. And, and honestly... This card being 50 speed is kind of relevant because when you're playing against like these kind of units, yeah. if you have like a, a power boost yeah. or a few of them, you can kill these. Whereas yeah. the sand crawl is just yeah, going to eventually just get nuked. Yep. Yeah. Go ahead. I'm at six. All right. Um. Yeah. I think we're just going to play a Falcon. Okay. For five points and draw a card. Okay. Done. All right. Let's do... Seems like the time to do this. Let's just play... uh, Secret, Secret Caesars, Caesars? the yep. big dog. The big dog. Oh wow! All right. So that card's six, still so good. Three. So in 2005, at the last Gen Con Championship, I talked myself out of playing um, my Darth Maul deck because mm. I was like, you know what, Darth Maul, he's just been played so many times. Revenge of the Sith was just released really not that long ago couple maybe only a couple months Mm -hmm. and i was like you know i'm gonna play secret sidious because he's gonna be better at killing um yoda Mm jay i don't know if that was correct i think i would have rather have had maul probably just the force train 
Well, not just the four strain, but Maul, like A, with the plus five. That's true. Just rolling he all the just... extra dice at once. Yeah. The Secret City is, though, is super annoying. Yeah. Because of You the... have to use the evade right away. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Orko asked, is this young Jedi? I never got into Star Wars TCGs. Not sure what you mean by young Jedi. Uh, so what he means is there's a there's another game that came out. I think it was by Decipher. It, it was I'm not sure what company made it. I think it was Decipher. It's called Young Jedi. Mm. So you know when we go to Gen Con every year and we go to the like those uh, booths that have all the discount like all the all the dead card games up there mm-hmm. and you can buy like the sealed product. Yep. And you know how they always have Star Wars cards there, but never this card? Yeah. Young Jedi is what they have. Got it. <laughs> so, uh, it's a very simple game. It just was not that popular. Mm-hmm. Um, for me, it was... The only worse than Young Jedi was probably uh, Pocket Models. Star Wars Pocket Models was probably like... I think it was I called Pocket Models. It was like this a card game where you had to s- assemble like little ships and things. That sounds horrible. Yeah, it was made by Upper Deck. It was pretty bad. Um, I think I'm just going to play Jabba's Barge. Okay. For five. But yeah, Young Jedi. I tried it. I've tried every Star Wars game. I've given it a chance. Okay. So, let's do three Commerce Guild. Go ahead. <sighs> okay. I mean, I am not sure what to do. Okay. I'm falling into my trap you have. Ah. Whether it's what, a good trap or not, I don't know. But, <laughs> uh, so I guess I haven't put these up. So yeah. I played that before. And then Big Papa right here. Yeah. And Ron has played just a- Java Sail Barge and that guy. Yep. So I am at, what, 19? Mm-hmm. 19. So, we are going to do four more. So, we're just playing another big mm-hmm. cloud car. These things are actually good at killing patrol mode vulture right? Yeah, they, they are kind of so cheap. Dice. They're, yeah, they, and they're fast. They and have a lot of dice. Yep. And, yeah. and we're going to draw. So... <laughs> Man. So four, ten, fifteen, eighteen, twenty one. Right? Four, eight, ten. Four, eight, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty three. All right, so what do I want to do with the rest of my build points here? Oh, it's about... Oh, yeah, it is your turn, isn't it? It is still your turn. Yeah, it's still my turn. Um... Oh, Lordy, Katra said he has pocket model cards next to him. Three foils. (laughs) Are you old enough for that? (laughs) It was one of the later games. It was one of the later games. The game was busted though. Like Darth Darth Ted went they oh, they did not so pocket models. They didn't have like uniqueness when it first came out, so Darth Ted went to like a tournament and like Darth Vader's tie was like the best thing in the game and he just ran all Darth Vader's ties in the deck and crushed everyone. Pretty sounds hilarious. Like, sounds like him. Uh I don't know what to play here. Uh we'll play a Han Solo in character. Okay. Okay. I will do another one of these.
these guys for three. John. And then put two on another one. Okay. I have one point left. I'm just going to stack on. Yeah. For one. So, uh, if you haven't seen, uh, this is just the transport pilot. It gives a transport lucky three. He has lucky three himself. And then I'm actually stacking the A uh, for one because I get to draw an extra card. Okay. And then I could always flip him for free and mm -hmm. then toss him on here if I don't want him to fight Sidious. Yeah. Which I'm not sure Han's going to be dueling with Mr. Sidious over there. That's fair. Okay. All right, roll for build. Yep. I'm drawing a card. Four force. Yep. One. Beat a one. Good job. Well, I guess we'll deploy my commerce skills. <laughs> <laughs> That's the nice thing about having cheap units, huh? Yeah. Okay. Man. Okay. I'm going to draw. You know what? I probably should still just damage Mass and do something. So. Oh, sure. Go for it. Um, yeah, damage him for a free build no point. There's no reason not to. Yeah, there's no reason so. not to. Alright, so I drew. I'm going to draw a bonus for Han Solo. Okay. And then I have two build points. So... What to do with two build points? Um, you know, Han probably won't die on the first turn. You would have to get six out of seven, so I could probably keep him around. Um, Alright, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw two build... I'm going to throw two build here. And... Question is, do I want three, three dice from the skiff? Probably. Yep. Alright. I'm okay. going to stay. Mm -hmm. All right. So, retreats, retreats. None. I have none. Alright. So, space taps. You don't want to retreat Masa Meta? Uh, I do it at the start of the character battle step. No. Right? Oh, no. No. Only if he's the oh, only, only if he's the only one. So oh, if you okay. don't retreat yeah, him, fine. actually, I can go and merc Attack him. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. <clears throat> so space, I've got nothing. Yep. Ground, do you want to spend any force? Um. This guy costs two force. These guys cost three each. Three each. Yep. Good lord. Um. I guess I'll tap. Yeah, it depends on what battle cards you want to play. Because you're exactly. definitely going to want to spend two force to... Cause to he, evade three, He rolls sure. five dice with accuracy, so it's not yeah. nothing. Yeah. So you'll definitely want to pay two evade three. Yeah, Question for is, sure. what do you want your other two force for? Right. Do you want it to just guarantee remove three dice with accuracy? Probably. Okay. Yes, the down, you're seeing the downside of the cloud car come in here. Yep. All right, so I've just got these. Mm -hmm. Um, I can't see the speed because you're covering them. They're all fifty. Up. Okay. All your guys are like twenty and forty. Yeah, uh, but he's, he's 50. fifty. So he would go first. Yep. And these guys, if you deal them damage, they actually lose power for every damage you deal to them. Right. So it's so probably that's where worth we're going. Going there. Yep. All right, so two dice. One, one hit. So one damage. And okay. So I'm going next. Now my issue is I could try to take out that if I try to take this out and I get it, that would be huge. Yeah. That would probably be the game. <laughs> that would be strong. So it and the question is I don't know how many Jedi piloting she's got in her hand. She could also have Imperial Misdirection, which that would put me in a real bind because I would damage it and then she would just get rid of him. Um, I think I have no choice. I mean, so here's the options I'm thinking as a player. I, I could get rid of the big threat, or at least work on trying to get rid. I can't. I'm highly unlikely to kill it this turn, even with I would have four power and three power, so eight dice with accuracy. Yeah, it's still good. Or 
I could try to work on the ion cannon units and concede essentially concede this arena mm-hmm. and just try to take out all the ion cannon units yeah. and then go for these two. But Han is not going to kill, so I think I have to go at the patrol mode. Yeah. So I'm going to roll four dice at the patrol mode. Yep. Well, that guy rolls three, but that's fine. Tap this four. one first instead. You tapped the one that was damaged. Yeah, because I was going with that one and only rolling four dice. Oh, he has shields. shields. I was forgetting about the shields. Gotcha. So, All right, so horrible. One damage. Okay. All right. Then the other one's gone. Three dice. Two. All right, so All that right. was not a good start on the patrol mode. Okay, so my ion cannon guys are going next. So let's just work on these guys here. Yeah. So we'll work on the damaged one first. Yep, so two dice. Two dice with critical hit two. And four. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Four damage. Uh, I'm going to try to play a high-speed dodge for one force. And you will get that. Oh. So it'll take one. Yeah. I gotta make you earn it. That's fair. Okay. Okay, so then same target. Mm-hmm. Two, Two again. Ouch. Okay. And same target. Okay. Three. Three. Yowzers. Okay. okay. And then, uh, oh no, my guy goes first. Oh yeah. Hilarious. Um, but I think we want to use him on this guy. That makes Just sense. try to take him out. Two, four, six, eight. That's the danger of not doing a lot of damage. Yep. And accuracy one. Yep. Crunch. It's accuracy didn't really come into play. Five. Five. Which is enough, unless you have a card. Uh, no, he's dead. All right. Ouch. And Java. now, and now you can see everyone who's watching. They can see why I was considering just trying to take out some a of couple, these little guys, a couple of these guys, because that did not work out for me at all. Mm-hmm. Now I only dealt, uh, so I dealt three damage. I would have had one more dice going at each of them. Reality is, maybe I killed one. Yeah. But I don't know. We'll see. Okay. Um, Han, you're going to have to uh, do some... Oh, this guy. Yeah, that's right. So, now we have three. So, I think the ship has sailed on killing this. I mean, you're not going to kill one of these with three dice. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to still go patrol mode. Might as well. One. Just keep blinking at it. And... Han. Han. Rolling five. Yep. Four. All right. So we're going to pay, pay two, two evade evade three. three. Take one. And then seven dice from Sidious. Yep. And I have no point in guessing. Yep. One. One. All right. I like that. Don't roll bad dice for me. That's not nice. Hey, I let you. I roll uh, super hot dice for you in ground. <laughs> Wrecked me. All right. Two. And I'm rolling terrible. Oh, that was my force. Yeah. Okay. Two. Hit three. All right. So. You're up, dark side. We'll damage Moss to get an extra one. And. Let's use my Reek to draw and discard. Decisions, decisions. All right, let's mm-hmm. 
This just seems fun. I don't think I've ever actually played this. Sith Saber. And then we're gonna pay one force and one build point. Yeah, that's to equip it that's, to Sidious. That's terrifying on Sidious. Seems fun. Okay. I don't think I've ever done it, so let's do something. Nine gamey. dice, crit two, and if you're a force user, having to um, deal with the secret dice. Mm. All right, draw. Yep. Draw an extra card for Han Solo. Okay. Um, I have three, so I'm gonna spend one to play a skiff. Did you not get force? I used one for to equip this. Ah. Although now I kind of wish I didn't. Okay. <laughs> Be a themey. Then I don't know. I have two build left. Hmm. <laughs> I think we're going to put two build. I think we're going to put two build here. And. Man. So, Han. I could give him Lucky. No. Alright, so Han's slipping. Okay. I think Han's out of dodge. He's going to pilot the Falcon. Okay. Keep his little damage counter there. And that's it. So we're going to go to space, which will do nothing. Yep. And then we're going to go to ground. Yep. And do you want to pay force to tap this? Um, sure. Okay. It's fine. Okay. And then... Go ahead. We'll roll... We'll pay two... Just roll at the patrol mode. What do you mean pay two? Or roll... I'm uh, just rolling two. Oh, okay. One damage. One. And my 40s. So let's let's work on Java Sail Barge. Okay. So two dice. Two. Three. Three. Ugh. Same target. Oh Five, my gosh. Four. All right. So don't complain. Uh, he's, that's dead. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna say he's dead. All right. All right, and then we'll go with the cloud car, I guess. Yep. One. All right, and then we'll go with the skiff. Yeah. This game's over. Yeah. Uh, Accuracy. Yeah, so four. Yeah. Five. All right. Okay. Ouch. Okay. And... Character taps. Yep. And then next turn. Yep. I shouldn't have moved Han over. That was stupid. But with that ground roll, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Oh, I don't draw yet. Yeah, I was going to say you don't draw a card yet. Um, force. Yep. Roll for build. Six. Six. All right. Oh, man. Let's do four on uh, slave one. Okay. I already have a build point on this, so I'll just stack it. Okay. Uh, I totally just confused myself. Um, I think my force was five. Uh, yeah, you had one force left. And that was my, okay. 
So then... And you rolled a six, so I spent four. So this should be a two. That's why I was confused. All right. Then... We will do... Splinter for one. What are you getting? Another slave one. Okay. Another stun one. Yep. I'll shuffle this. I'll damage Masameda to get another build point. And stack it. And stack it on top. Ouch. Okay. My turn? Yep. Alright. Okay. Hmm. I'm out of ground units. to go in character. Sounds terrible. We will spend three. Not two on here. I'll spend four, I guess. To play Lando. This went two. Uh, stack the Falcon for one. Stack Han for one. Oh, I should have used my reek. I didn't think about it. And then. I think that's it. Alright. Uh, okay. Do you have any retreats? Um, Moss, yeah. yeah. Okay. Alright, I have none. Okay. Space it is. Space. Uh, you're up. Yep, so uh, five, six, seven at Falcon. Yep. Roll. Oh, that's right. <laughs> You have the dice. Um, do I want to intercept here? Seven went stun two. Probably. Intercepting? Yeah. Okay. Dead. Yep. But importantly, my falcon's not stunned. It's true. So we're going to roll five dice with the falcon. He has accuracy. Four hits. Four. All right, we are going to pay one for a high speed dodge. All right, and pay I'm going to spend one force to disrupting strike that. So you have to spend two force. Force. Two force, or it's disrupted. Um, that's fine. I'll spend another two force. Okay, and then I'll disrupting strike it again. So you have to spend two more force, or it's disrupted. What the heck? That's mean. It's not mean. Yes, it is. Um, does Han give everybody lucky or just himself? Just himself. Just himself. So it's how much damage? It's four. I think I need to save it for an evade. Yep. Okay. Mean. Spent all my fours. Yeah. Alright. You want to tap this? No. Alright. Two dice at the uh, patrol mode vulture droid. Two. Okay. Alright. Alright. 
two dice. One. Okay. Shooting up in space. All right. Two Shields. Dice. Zero. Three. Ugh. All right. Well, spend a force and high speed out of that. Okay. Zero. All right. Crunch your best pink cloud car. I don't yeah, think I, mean, you don't I don't think moves. we need to roll. Nope. All right. <laughs> Eight dice accuracy one. And he has one health left. Pretty sure he's toast. All right. Okay. And Han goes first. Uh, seven dice. So. Two. Oh, three. Because he is lucky. He is. Or two. I mean, no, he doesn't have accuracy anymore, right? He, no he just has luck. So it's two right now, and then you re-roll three. Yep. Did I lose a die? I lost a die somewhere. Oh, Ooh. five. Five? All right. Well, All we right. got to pay two, evade three. Take three. Okay. And actually, now I've got to read Secret Sidious, because I don't remember how Lucky works with this card. Roll Sidious attack dice secretly. Show them to your opponent after damage prevention. So... I don't think Lucky counts, does it? Well, I could use Lucky, right. but I don't know which dice I'm telling you to re-roll. Really? Yeah, because after damage... Lucky counts as damage prevention? No, Lucky happens before damage prevention. So I so secretly, oh. you roll them, and I don't see the dice until... Okay. <laughs> so actually That's you, awkward. Yeah, so you're actually not going to roll these ones on camera. Okay. So you'll roll your nine dice secretly. Okay. So you'll roll nine dice. Okay. And just roll them so I can't see them. And then line them up one through nine, essentially. Okay. Um, use a dice tray. I guess yeah. I can use a dice tray. Yeah. Man, I lost a die. Yeah, you'll find that die later. It's right here. This is exciting, right. actually. Have it this had is awkward. <laughs> all right. Say, so, yeah, so you uh, roll them all in that box. Okay. And I won't know which lucky ones. Okay. All right. And then, so, so then I have to line them all up? Line them up one through nine, essentially. Yeah. And I have to pick numbers to tell you to re-roll. Right. And I'm going to, like, shuffle these around. Yeah, I don't know what what's what. So. I know, but, like, I'm not going to line them up highest to lowest. No, 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 no. Because you're just... So I would never know what how you line them up. Yeah. Okay, so re-roll dice. Let's say re-roll dice two, four, and nine. Okay. These ones I can see. All right, so I kept that one. So only three. Oh, did I make you re-roll any? Two of them. Oh, good, good. All right. So you, lo you, met, you took away one of my hits. Hilarious, okay. All right. And no sixes? No, you made me re-roll it. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Okay. Yep. All right. Does he have all this damage on him? Yes. Oh, yeah. Nice. All right. Lando. Unfortunately. Rolling five. Three hits. Seriously? Yeah. He's dead. Oh. Eat that, Sidious. All those force points. Okay. Force points, what do you mean? Uh, you had no force points. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. 100%. Force. Yeah. yeah. Alright. Force points that I got for no reason. Because <laughs> my unit still took a shit. <laughs> well, you kind of got greedy. You should just let that thing die. And just kept all the force. Because if you just keep force, I'm not I'm not winning here. Eventually, just Sidious just wins the war. You, just, you were just wanting to get greedy and crush me in all three arenas. No. That's what happened. Four. For build? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Drum. You get five. Oh, no, you, no. Get you get four. You get five with Moss. Which is going to happen. Yeah, because you really didn't even need to keep the Slave 1 in space. You're still ion canning me every turn in, from ground. 
So all you need to do is win character. Now you've made it just a little harder on yourself. Oh, I totally don't know what my force was. No idea. Yeah, me either. I, I know I had some force. For sure. So I'll You had just, two dice of force at one point. Yeah, so, so I'll just say eight. I have no idea what you Two had. for last turn, two for this turn. If the if the uh, live chat knows how much force I was supposed to have, they could say, <laughs> but I do not remember. Five. I spent two. I, we'll, I spent uh... two force last turn on two disrupting strikes, and it's been forcing and, and a high speed dodge. So I spent three. So at most, if I had. I don't know. I have no idea what you had. I have no clue. T I think chat said something. No, they didn't. Oh, no. Okay. Let's... Baby Boba. <laughs> okay. And... You're going to use Moss? I already did. Huh. I guess we'll do... Two there. Mm-hmm. And then we'll... So one thing you could have done is you could have played Boba first... Then put the damage on him because he's got like health that's free. He's never gonna not. He's never gonna fight. He's just gonna be out of pilot. I mean, he's just. I'll do that on the next turn. He's just gonna retreat. But but then you would have to move him off to put the damage on him because he's not a unit once you pilot him. So, really? Yeah. What? Yeah. Once a unit's a pilot, it's not a unit or a character. It's a pilot. So you oh, would you would okay. have to do it that way. All right. I thought you okay. Yeah. So anything that targets that a character, then. anything that targets a character or a unit. Um, it can't target it once once a once something be, be, is a pilot, it's no longer a unit or a character. It's okay. just a pilot. Okay. I probably played that wrong in the past, but that's fine. Didn't know. That's not a big deal. All right, draw. Mm -hmm. Uh, flip. Oh, you know what? I'm sorry. I'm gonna draw just quick. Oh, sure. I'm sorry. I'm gonna flip. Go ahead. Four build. Um, obviously we are spending one point. Oh, I don't want to flip here, though. Hmm. Now what do I do? Okay. Treat. Mm -hmm. oh, I totally forgot about this ability to search for a location and put three build on it. Oh. No big deal. Okay. Um, I forgot. My fault. And... Yeah, you're up. What are you doing with IG? IG's Damage getting power. Power, yeah. Okay. Um... Let's roll at IG. Shields, armor. Yeah. So. yeah All right, so still rolling seven dice. Yep. Um, I need to borrow some of the dice that are in the uh, dice tray. Okay. Uh, three damage with armor. There's another six in there. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, yes. No, three hits. Yep, you're right. Three. Oh, you're using all the threes, no, huh? there's one right here. It's just hiding. Okay. And that means stun three. Yep. 
so 60 speed, and we're rolling 5. With accuracy at slave 1. And that's cocked. 4 hits. I lost. Ah. Oh, close game. Yeah. Sad. All right. I thought that game was not going to go well for me, but it was that one turn. All right, everybody. Well, that was best of three. Um, we'll be back next week. I think we're going to try and keep it to a regular Wednesday schedule. As, lo as long as uh, COVID-19 is in effect, we'll be playing every Wednesday. So uh, this is Gold Leader and Patronus, and we'll see you next week. Yep.